What's up guys, Kevin here from Snowboard Pro Camp. In this video, I wanna show you 10 beginner skills you can learn on your first day of snowboarding. These skills are gonna help you get around the mountain, go down your first run, and prepare you for the chairlift. Everyone learns at their own pace, so it's okay if you spread these skills over a few days. The first skill you're gonna learn is how to skate. Skating is how you get around with one foot strapped into your board. This skill will get you to the run and also to and from the chairlift. I prefer to skate with my free foot behind my board, using it to push me across the flat area. You also need to know how to walk up hills. The best way to walk up a hill is to put your board across the slope and walk with your free foot in front of your board. With each step you take, dig in your toe edge. This will stop your snowboard from sliding downhill. Now that you can skate and walk up hills, it's time to do some one-footed riding. This is a skill that's absolutely necessary for getting off the chairlift. To practice, find a very small slope where you can point your board straight and ride with your free foot between your bindings. To stop yourself, move your free foot to the edge of your board and drag your heel or toe in the snow. When you're ready to go down a small slope, the first thing you need to do is strap up with both feet. If you need to put your board down for a second, make sure your snowboard is upside down so it doesn't slide away. The easiest way to do this is to sit down facing the bottom of the run with your board below you. Strap your board up one foot at a time with your knees bent so you can reach the straps. Once you're strapped up, it's time to stand up and start sliding. To stand up, start by reaching one hand forward and grabbing your board. Use this hand to pull yourself up and at the same time, push yourself up from behind. If you find this hard, get a friend to help you up the first few times. Your first time down the slope, you're just going to be controlling your speed by sliding on your heel edge. With the heel slide, the more you lift your toe edge away from the snow, the more your heel edge will dig in and slow you down. As you slide, your body should be balanced over your board with your knees and hips bent, your back fairly straight, with your hands at your sides. To slide back and forth, point your hand and put a little more weight into the direction you want to go. You also want to learn to control your speed on your toe edge, but because we haven't gotten to turning yet, we'll have to sit down and roll over. The easiest way I find to roll over is to lay back, grab your leg and pull your board over as you roll. For toe sliding, you control your speed by lifting your heel edge away from the snow to slow down, or let your heels get closer to the snow to slide faster. Think of pushing your knees forward into the snow as you slide to help dig your toes in more. Slide back and forth across the hill by looking and pointing in the direction you want to go. Once you're confident controlling your speed with your heels and toes, it's time to get your board to go straight down the hill. Find a beginner area to try this where you won't pick up too much speed. To make your board go straight, start by putting more weight over your front foot. At the same time, point your front hand and shoulder downhill and your back hand and shoulder uphill. With your board going straight, you can take the pressure off your board's edge and let your snowboard run flat. Next, you want to turn your board and control your speed. Just like you were practicing with the heel and toe sliding, your board needs to be across the hill and on edge to control your speed. For the toe turn, you need to turn and face the top of the slope. At the same time, apply pressure to your toe edge. For the heel turn, turn and face the bottom of the slope.
and at the same time, put pressure on your heel edge to turn your board and control your speed. So I hope this video will give you a good idea of what to expect on your first day of riding. Use the hashtag first day riding to connect with other people learning to snowboard and to share photos and videos of your experience. Remember to give this video a thumbs up if it helped you out. If you have any questions about these 10 skills, you can leave them in the comment section. Check out the beginner snowboard playlist for more tips. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.